I'm very nervous about being on the chase again because last time I actually got caught. Uh, so, yeah, I thought I'd give it another go, but at least if I get booted out this time, I know how that rejection feels. I'm feeling a little nervous. I've got to, I've got to admit, like, I've watched the show um, and some of the questions are not easy, and those guys seem to know everything, those chasers. So I've got Carol, I've got Holly, and I've got Adam, and I've got to say, all three of them seem quite good. And what worries me about that is, is that it's going to be a repeat of last time that them three get thrown up. Um, I'm hoping the subjects that will come up will be um, R&B in the 1990s. I'm probably best at will be the natural world, so animals, plants, that sort of stuff. I'm really hoping I do not get maths and geography. Can't add up, never know where I'm going. The worst subject for me will be anything that's not Spice Girls Steps or Big Brother related. I think the, maybe the quick fire questions are going to be the easiest. Not the easiest, but the least concerning. I don't know. Maybe I'll crumble under pressure. I'm hoping I'm good at the cash builder. When I was playing on the app, I was pretty good at the cash builders and terrible at everything else. So I think I start strong and then really peter out. I think that's probably something about my career. Do you see what I mean though? Do you see what I mean? Yeah. So I was here, my answer was actually B, and I'm looking at the question there, so I'm reading the question there, yeah, yeah. and you're like, right, right, it's that, so I've gone, yeah. I think I would like to face the governess. She's really, really clever, but I think she's kind as well. And because she's my um, animal spirit guide. Well, maybe Sean. I, I, I just like the sort of clinical cold mortuary hands of a mind that Sean has. I hate all of the chasers, so it really doesn't affect me what one I get. All I hope is that I have a good day. You know what it's like, sometimes you could be answer everything, I watch shows like this on the telly and I'm like, why aren't I on that team? I've got every single one right and then other days you can't remember where you live. I'm in exactly the same seat as I was before, seat number four. So I've got to sit there and watch everyone do well and then step up to the plate. And I'm not looking forward to it one bit. I'm not confident in the slightest. I mean, I'll talk and I'll say stuff, but I don't really know what's coming out of my mouth. And I know I'm dreading it. I dreamt about this as a kid. Walking in slow-mo. This is the end.